Hey, what up, legends? How's it going? Kiwin Bacon here. Now, today I'll be playing this week's Brawl, and I've got two different decks to show you guys. But before we do anything, a little bit of shameless self-promotion. Um, I'm doing a giveaway on Sunday on this channel, giving away 15 Hearthstone card packs, one of these deals, to one of you guys. All you've got to do to participate in that is be subscribed to my channel. So you just click that red button down there, and uh, that makes you eligible for these packs and then you leave a comment letting me know what you think about what which one is your favorite deck out of the two that we'll be playing and um i'll enter you in a draw for those so good luck to you and to everyone now this week brawl is pretty interesting but you're gonna see a lot of hunters because it's double death rattle battler um and we're gonna be playing two different decks the first one we'll be playing is going to be this one which I call the OTK Much on Heartpawn, and I'll put the link in the description for that. And right after this game, I'll show uh, the second deck, which I called Shadows Die Twice, which is also going to be in the description, and hopefully you guys enjoy that. Your own dinosaurs, which you can get out on turn three if you start with the coin, which is usually pretty interesting. Um, the uh, the ideal start is that uh, devil sore egg slash weapon uh, combo. Not gonna happen right now. We we are playing against a rogue, which is quite interesting. I w I don't want to keep this sad, but I should. But I don't want to. This is okay. This is weird. I do enjoy me some rogue. To be honest, so we'll see what the matchup is. Blight Nuzzle Crawler is pretty darn gross. You pop it, it dies in, you can kill two things for four mana with the body. Um, and sometimes you don't want the body, right? You just want the, the four fours. I mean, I'm sorry, the, the one ones that kill stuff. Uh, but it's, it's a really good card because you can trade with something first, right? And then you can... Use the, the little poisonous oozes coming out to remove some threats or something. <sighs> okay. That is pretty gross. Do not appreciate that. Um, I will get... I will get the blade. So we'll use that now. Then next turn we can Blight Nuzzle Crawler, the Blight Nuzzle Prox. We get those two oozes. We trade into the five fives. I'm taking a billion damage for sure, but it's better than nothing, I guess. So we'll see how that all pans out for us. There's also the the Spellstone that could be a potential play, but the issue there is that it could hit the Devil Sword again, and you just get some more five fives. So. Roll the bones. Okay, so he rolls the bone. <laughs> okay, that's interesting. Roll the bones for one. Then it's my turn. Alright, so let's go with that Blight Nuzzle Crawler. Pop this. Kill these two. Boom, boom. And pass. Eh. Could have been better. I do still have the minion on the board. So that's nice. The question is, was that really what I wanted? And the answer is... Eh? I don't know. I don't know if that's what I wanted. Now, the Necreon Vial rocks four times that can be pretty insane so i hope he doesn't get it anytime soon that's a nice eviscerate there well played my friend all right okay so let's attack here i'm going to play my shiny finder as well as this Egg Napper. Can I get that second blade going? 
if anything ever happens, you know, th this is a thing still. We can still do it. We still got the other, the other creepy crawly. So that's good for us. We're basically playing the, well, maybe not the exact same deck, but a very similar deck, which is really neat. Um, though I believe mine is a little better. That's just because I created it myself. His is full of golden cards, though, so that's a plus. I don't know if he's ever going to stop not playing cards. It's, it's a little frustrating, but, you know. Ooh, neat. Neat. Okay. Um... So I could play this weapon. And I could also play this crawler. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do that right now because A getting him closer to zero. And B, um his shit's gonna die. And if <laughs> the cool part, if anything happens. There's always that moment where I just go like, nope. Either A, everything dies, or B, you can get it back in your hand. Do not care. So that's what I like about this deck, is being able to have some options for those, uh, those nope moments. Those nope moments are the best. <laughs> Does he kill the... Hmm. Does he keep? Does he kill the creepy crawly there? What, what is he doing? The sky and your tail Squeeze me. Huh. Okay. Um. See, so what I could do here is just smack, smack. And then just vanish. Get these dudes back. Play Eggnapper. Smack his face. And then I get a bunch of one ones. Play my creepy crawly. The guy's at three. Um that's pretty much it. Right? You did play Aviana there. That was a weird that was a weird play, my dude. But I can understand. Overall, that was a pretty good game. Hmm. The only thing that I could see would be somehow eviscerate pff, Shiv eviscerate fan of knives, but is he really playing that? I don't think so. He's not playing the other deck we were playing. So, I doubt he can survive. I wonder. All right. He must have left. <sighs> Unless he's got a taunt. No, no, well. Maybe he's trying to get his own vanish. In which case, sure, go for it. <laughs> There we go. So that was Shadows Die Twice as a rogue deck for the Brawl. Alright. Playing against the Hunter, of course. Um, and while we don't really have anything in our hand, you are with the first deck um, looking for Elven Minstrel. If you don't get it, it can get a little complicated. Um, but since we're playing against Taunter, there are cards that are extremely important for us to get. Those cards are Sap and Vanishes. Because, um, well, our opponent has a goal. And his goal is to make as many dinosaurs as fast as possible. Um, and that usually end up happening real fast. Either that or he plays Bomb Hunter. Um, he tries to place down as many bombs as possible and just deal four damage each to you that usually ends up not being too good uh in her case so we'll try to make sure that doesn't happen 
we are going to need that uh, elven minstrel for sure if i could draw one that would be fantastic in fact if i could draw one before turn three um i would be i would be impressed by before turn three i mean right now it's gonna be my next top deck so let's go so far, this isn't going so great. Well, it's not going so great. We just don't have exactly what we want. Yeah, we knew that was happening. Okay, I do have Malagos. Um, so as long as I manage to kill this, eh, there might still be a way. There might, there might actually still be a way. Okay, I'm going to wait on the sap, because sapping this is alright, but it's not super fantastic. What's better is sapping a dinosaur, which I assume he's going to have at some point. Okay, so play dead, that we can most likely sap a dinosaur, so he's going to have one dinosaur on the board. Ooh, good, okay, so prep, sap, minstrel, get the minstrel. And then out of that, we draw the Shiny Finder and the other Minstrel. We have to find a way to survive a little bit. But since I've got the Illusionist and the Minstrel, it's a little easier for us to actually trigger the, the Illusionist. Um, because, of, because of... Oh, here's a weapon. Okay, so... What's going to happen now... So I'm going to play the Shiny Finder. Play this Blade. Gotta get rid of the Minstrel. So I'm going to go face. Because the more damage I deal to him, the less I need to inflict upon him with the Illusionist. So we'll see how that goes. Probably not too well. Hmm. Okay. Now, the, the Minstrel being in my hand is actually bad for me. And if I could get a... If I could get a Backstab, that'd be fantastic. I, I'd be I'd be very happy. Or, or Vanish. Backstab or Vanish. Shiv is not so great. Um, okay, so I'll play this dude. Let's hope it hits Malagos. Because if it doesn't, well, I'm kind of screwed. Cool. So now it hits Malagos, and then we have this for 11. And then coin, Sister Strike for another 11. And that is... I'm sorry, 13. That is the win. So, that's pretty much it. Um, I do realize it was a 50-50. But sometimes you do have to get in those situations. Um... Have some fun. Try some. Try some clever decks. Try to have some some enjoyment out of this brawl, and that's basically what it's all about, right? Oh, and well, also the pack, right? <laughs> so you'll get a pack pretty easily with one of those two decks. Just choose whichever one you prefer, um, and let me know in the comment section whichever one you you liked most. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks a lot. Bye bye.